Right, Simba's return. This level's sick. This one looks amazing. You got Pride Rock in the background. I think it's pretty easy. Like, you don't lose lives in this level, but it just takes ages because it is a maze. See all these doors? I don't remember anything. I'm just going to go with my instinct on the basis that somehow I will have remembered it. Like, subconsciously. <laughs> um, like, just then in that first area, I just went straight to the end. That was purely just like an instinctive, I think that's where I need to go, but I can't remember why or if that's true or not. Like, the thing is, just you've got to fight these hyenas reliably without without dying, basically. Oh, and that's the other thing. This is this area has just reminded me. You need to kill the hyenas in the area before it will let you use the door out. So I need to come down here just to kill these guys. And then I go back up here to rock through the door. So that actually, this implies that I'm doing the right route because I remember these areas. <laughs> Oh dear. I got the health, I got the health, I take the health. Yes. And what? What should we go with, guys? I'm gonna take this door. It's instinct. It's probably wrong. If it was right. Oh, come on. Oh, this is not looking good. Oh, deep. Deep. Okay, yeah, I remember not dying, but <laughs> uh, maybe I was better at the game then. I'm going to leave that health there, because if, if you fuck up the maze, you end up coming back. Right. Nice. Alright, serious. See, when they jump, you just gotta be close to them. The problem with when they jump is if you're not right next to them, then they'll mash you up. Okay, that was sick. That was also sick. Alright, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Yes. Saved the health. Is this one we went in? I think it was. Felt like the right option. Yes! Yes, Simba. Serious. Up here? The tunes on this level are sick as well. I rate the tunes. I rate the chanting. Let's get up here. The little man's not going to be able to touch me. Let's get up here as well. Just isolate the beef. Yep. Thank you. Nah, no, not allow it. Allow it. Is there some health on this in this area anywhere that I could perhaps make use of? It's not gonna let me through. No, I see it doesn't let me through. I need to kill those guys down there. Oh, snap, I'll take that. Why did it give me that? Let's not complain. All right, let's go rinse this guy in the corner. Hopefully the others won't notice. They noticed. Uh, 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 serious. Okay, I need some health in this next area. Pronto. Um, no. And I've been here before, innit? So I took a wrong turn, I think. <laughs> Too much. Um, damn. Ooh, guide. Alright, so... We're just going to have to process of elimination this one, then. Um... I think I was right to go in here. Yeah, so in that area though, it's I'm like just trying to remember where we went. Alright, it does get repetitive though. This is where... This is what I'm talking about with like... The way these games were just... They made you just use trial and error to complete it. 
Okay, that was bait. I need to be a little bit more thoughtful with my strategy here. That's good. That's decent. I'm going to need the health straight away in this area, I think. Okay. It's a shame when they all split up like that because... All right, nice. So we went in there and then we came out up here. So I'm thinking, let's go for the one closest to where we came in on the basis that it's a trick. What? No, I'm not. <laughs> no, that's... That's just some old school bait programming glitching me out. Okay, never mind. I think that was right though. I think, like, my instincts tell me that was the right way to go. So we'll just rinse these guys again. Very nice. Yep, up. And down. Okay, I'm getting proficient now. Sure, hyena hunter. Smashing dudes. Nice. Alright. Come on, give me a break. Rinsed, rinsed, and rinsed. It keeps turning me like you arrive in an area and it turns you straight away away from the guy you're trying to beef. No, come on, allow me. What am I supposed to do? Okay, sweet. <laughs> what a dickhead. Um. All right, all right. All right, patience, Daniel, patience. Deep breath. We got this. <laughs> this is probably not the most entertaining viewing, just watching me fight hyenas <laughs> over and over again quite badly probably as well I'm sure there's a lot of people shouting at the screen here um, it's that old uh, just trying to rush through the game again causing me uh, to waste more time smashed it next that was sick that was less sick I'm stuck I'm just stuck on the spikes okay interesting just you know variety natural variety states that different things will happen wow they were like synchronized just dancing around me there oh, I could have pulled that off a bit better but all in all that was pretty sweet that was pretty well executed see when you press mm. Mm, foul play Okay, nice. Alright, smashed him. So I think I need to wait here and he'll jump off. Or if I go over there like that or something. Yes. Alright, now I can fight him down here. Legitimately. Smashed him. Alright, so I'm probably going to pick the wrong turn here. And then we'll be done okay that looked like the right turn because we've not been here before oh I'm gonna take that health immediately four of them in this area yes yeah yeah 
Alright, this is the final level, guys. Pry rock. Oh, straight away a beef with Scar. So yeah, he blocks you. So I need to look out for those jumps. And then try and get... Yeah, he put, put, turns his head up when he's about to jump. Alright. So then you run towards him. Yes. And then spark him in the face. Okay, yeah, I've got this guy's number already now. Oh. But you're supposed to, like, throw him on the floor or something, aren't you, I think? Like that. He's still going to kill me, though, just because he takes endless amounts of hits. <laughs> Alright. Alright, Scar. Alright, mate. Deep, you just come straight in. Oh dear. That was, <laughs> that was that was not what I was expecting. Let's get a roar out, Simba. Come on, be a man. Sparks guy in the face. Okay, all right, so basically uh, This move here leaves you vulnerable by the looks of things he just jumps on you and then just kills you in one So that's useful to know. I probably won't try and use that move <laughs> Yes This isn't all, all of the level as well by the way like you fight him here at the beginning, then there's platforming and like hyenas, standard, and uh, then you fight him again, I think, and then there's more platforming, more hyenas, and then you fight him a third time, and you have to chuck him off the cliff, and and then you then you're done. But like, from what I recall, chucking him off the cliff is not easy. You see how like before I managed to chuck him over my head um, it's not easily done I'm not even sure exactly what the like, I was never sure as a kid what the exact button combo is for that move so I think you just do damage to him when he's moving forwards when he's moving backwards he's got his block on so I can just stand here and keep sparking him. Okay, fine. <laughs> it always comes down to this. Just mashing one button. Um, if this is actually doing proper damage. Or if I do need to chuck him over my shoulder. Yes, okay, right. So that's how we do it. Then we wait for him to do the panting. And when he's panting like that, that's when we go in with the second attack. Okay, he gets bored, he runs off. Alright, we got it. Get a bit of health. Smash up some hyenas. Calm. Very good. This level looks sick as well. Like the artwork. Oh yeah, I forgot about the lightning. The artwork in these games, like, is legit. Like, you gotta, you gotta say. Can I go up there? Is there something? jump onto that one. Oh damn. <laughs> oh. Alright. We go again. Well that wasn't actually what I was after but okay. I would quite like that health but minor. Let's just crack on. Am I going to fight Scar again? He's going to appear. That lightning sound is not the most convincing lightning sound I've ever heard, though, I must admit. Okay, rinsed. No way. Okay, well, there's no full damage, at least. Because <laughs> if there was, that should have killed me. Oh, come on. This 
this is getting a bit long. I guess we can go the downstairs way, so to speak. Oh. That's literally just there for health. Wow. Okay. Okay. Alright, making moves. Yes, the lightning sound gives me so much jokes. <laughs> Definitely does not sound like lightning, mate. It sounds like something else. Here he is, the main man. So we just get back into our button mashing routine. I'm going to try and chuck him over my shoulder now, I think, after the next round of panting. Okay, so one hit. Pow! Still not done though, he wants more. Alright. He still wants the beef more, this is incredible. And they don't show you the health as well for a boss with no health. Do we are we just supposed to run past him at this point? Like do we just leave him here? Okay, okay. Nice. What's up here? I've got that curiosity about me. I need to know. Health. I'll take it. Is that it? That's it. Okay, fine. I think we're going to do this, guys, in this one life. Like, I can't see this level killing us. That's what I mean about that lava level being by far the hardest one in the game. It really is. Alright, I see what I'm after. There we go. Got ya. Okay, I do need to not get cocky though, because hyenas could just end me. Now this is it. This is... Is it? Is this it? I can jump there. Yeah, okay, nice. Okay. <laughs> so we got to run down to there. Cling on. Nice, I'll take it. Where else are you going to light up? Up here then. Thank you. Where's lit now? Downstairs we'll go. Okay, and then we'll jump up. And then up to there. Nice. What else we got around here? Go to there. Okay, I need to probably just wait for that platform, do I? Does the fire run out? I think it does. Or if I jump away, maybe. Oh, maybe I just gotta go up this way. Yep, okay. I think this is it now. Yeah, right, here we go. So I just gotta chuck him off the edge on the other side. So we're gonna take him to the edge. Just get over there, mate. Yeah, this is it, right. Okay, so we chuck him over, and now we just need to get make him come close and make him get his pant on. Okay, I'm pretty sick at button bashing, guys. I'm sure you can tell. This is some legitimate button bashing. I haven't seen a a checkpoint in this whole level, so. We don't want to die right now. 
I think he ain't panting because we need to like mash him up a bit more first before he'll pant for us here. I think he will eventually though. I'm, I don't want to try and do the move on him when he's not panting because I think he'll pin me down and just rinse me. And I have to do the whole level again, and I'm not about that life right now. There, he's right, he's panting now. Okay, I've got to keep my wits about me a little bit more. Let's get as close to the edge as we can. Oh, he did it again. Alright, he's definitely ready. He's definitely ready to take it. Oh, he was... <laughs> okay. The problem is if I leave it too too late, he's going to spark me again and I might die. So I need to play it right here. Come on, mate. <laughs> I mean, I think I started this uh, this series by making some sort of statement at the end of the first level, like they don't make boss fights like they used to. I, I take that back. This is lame. <laughs> like, <laughs> this is just ridiculous. Oh no! <laughs> no! Oh, okay. Oh, I do have to fight him again. Brilliant. I thought that, like, maybe I would just not gonna see him again until the end of the level, but apparently not. I've gotta actually fight him again. Okay, come on then, Scar. Also, the other thing that I realize about why they make games like with different control schemes and controllers and that now is like my hand is killing me. Like, I can feel it as soon as I take it, or like in between lives, and I take my hand off the keyboard, <laughs> it is mashed. Like, your hand is not supposed to be pressing. Oh, I flopped it. Well, on with the show. The king has returned. The king has returned. The king has returned. Yeah, oh, you hear, if you heard that crunch there, that was me cracking my fingernails. Finger, no, fingernails? Finger knuckles. My knuckles. Because, yeah, your hand is not supposed to just sit and mash one key like this. Take that. So deep. You think he's gonna gonna pant, but he doesn't always. So it does actually require quite a um, quick reaction. Um, yeah. There's a chance if this takes me ages that I might use now as a moment to cut to me actually finishing it because I've got six continues right, and I'm gonna want to finish this game. Like there's no doubt I'm sitting here until I've done it, but. To subject you guys to this is <laughs> possibly not great viewing, so I'm thinking uh, that if this does take me a long time, that that's my what might be what happens right now. Oh god! <laughs> oh god! All right.
All right, we're on the next approach to Scar. Here it is. Banging him up, banging him up. Just dash him around a bit up here, I think. First, just to weaken him. All right, we're gonna get him. We're gonna get him. This is it. Oh. Yes, yes, fam, we did it. That's it. That's the game clocked. You saw it here first. Probably you didn't, but you saw it here now. And yeah, we done it. And look, immediately, immediately, the weather improves. Like, it starts raining. Everybody's got a smile on their face. The flames, the licking flames, disappear. The tune is more uplifting. We've got a major key going on. We've got like a nice up tempo fall to the floor there on the African drums. Sick. Go on, Simba. You're a man. You're a lion king. Taking the place of Mufasa in the circle of life. So, I love this game. Clearly, I can still complete it. Thank you very much. It wasn't actually as difficult as I thought it might be. It was just a little bit more irritating. So actually, I think my conclusion is that games have improved. Like, these games have great nostalgia value. Um, at least, you know, if you've played them, obviously, as a kid, then the, the nostalgia is huge. Um, and and they were well designed. They're great little platform games. Like, But actually... Everything the light touches oh, go on, Mufasa. Yeah, after you. You know, they're, they're great little platform games. Um... But game design has improved, you know. We do perhaps expect um, expect more now than like this AI, and that's to be expected. The game was released in 1994. This game, um, big up all these men that made it. Big up Cindy Chin. Big up David Dame. <laughs> um, big up Paul Mudra. Audio, the audio direction. That audio is incredible. Um, I love all the old synths on these on these consoles. Anyway, I'm rambling. I think my point is uh, still a lot of fun, but you know, it its age shows. The age really does show in this game. Um, certain things about the level design, I suppose, just the trends in gaming nowadays. Um, I'm still gonna play the Aladdin one too. I'll probably do that series in a month or so. I need time to let my my like RSI and my left hand repair itself before I put my uh, put my hand through another mammoth session like that. Um, but thank you for watching the series. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you know of any other like old school platforms like this, I know they did a Jungle Book and a Pinocchio, um, which I never had as a kid. And then later on they did a Toy Story one, which I did have, but that was different. I don't think it was made by Virgin. Um, but let me know, anyway, you know, if you've got requests for games of this nature, um, holler at me, holler at your boy. Um, I've been Dankenstein, and as ever, peace.